Meantime, here in our region, new horrific video tonight in the tragic shooting of a nine year old girl in Woodbridge. Prince William County police say the girl was caught in crossfire, shot by a stray bullet while she was outside playing with her friends. She's now in critical condition. A warning for you here now. The video you're about to see shows the moments leading up to the gunfire. And you're going to hear the shots, but you will not see what happens when they're fired. Northern Virginia Bureau reporter Drew Wilder takes us through it. New video shows how the comfort of a community was stolen. One of the kids playing is an eight-year-old boy whose face we won't show, but he tells us about a day no child should be able to describe. So, like, I was playing tic-tac-toe with my friends. As a group of men walk down the opposite sidewalk, the kid's playfulness immediately changes. The kids seem to take cover behind the cars, and moments later, a silver car comes through the parking lot, turns around, and drives in the direction of the men. And as we freeze the video, you can hear the moment a neighborhood changes forever. A nine-year-old girl was hit by a stray bullet. She was rushed to the hospital where she's in critical condition. I was thinking that, that she would die. I was sad. The toys left lonely on the sidewalk as police filled this Woodbridge neighborhood to search for the shooter. Where children played Tuesday, their parents met today. Luckily, there was cars there that intervened with the rest of them even getting shot. How do you shoot in a crowd of kids? Yeah, how do you do you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Your kids. And I'm devastated. I, I can't. I can't do it. I can't handle it. The gun violence is exhausting. And because it persists, these families must adapt. I'm feeling sad because I can't play outside no more. Prince William County Police say they have interviewed the man who was the intended target of those gunshots. They say he's cooperating with police, and while they use that information to try to find the shooter, parents in this neighborhood try to figure out when or if they're going to let their kids play outside on these sidewalks again. Reporting in Woodbridge, Drew Wilder, News 4.